There's new information tonight in the death of a Henderson County woman. Earlier this week, we told you about Margaret Kelly, who was found dead at her home over the weekend, her son and car missing. Search warrants we obtained today show what police found inside the home. News 13's Darren Botello has our continuing coverage live from the Henderson County Courthouse. Darren. This paperwork describes a bloody scene. This comes as we learn her son, Brendan Allen, is being held in Florida where his mother's car was found. The question still remains, will he be charged with her murder? A suspicious death in Henderson County has turned into a homicide investigation. Authorities have detained a suspect in connection with the death of North Harper Drive resident Margaret Kelly on Sunday. It's her son, 28-year-old Brendan Allen. Neighbors like Jacqueline Coleman say they're still in disbelief. I was shocked. Totally shocked. Someone found dead in my neighborhood of suspicious causes. It just doesn't happen here. New information on the case was obtained by News 13 this afternoon. The search warrant says that Kelly's body was found lying face up on a couch near her front door with what appeared to be stab wounds to her upper left chest. The search warrant also goes on to say there were no weapons found near the crime scene, but three knives were among the evidence seized from Kelly's house. You know, anytime you have a, a death that obviously was not uh, natural, yeah. you're going to try and look for anything and collect anything that could possibly potentially be uh, evidence yeah. or a possible weapon that was used. Sheriff's deputies say Allen was found in South Florida with Kelly's 2008 Honda Civic. The car is headed back up to North Carolina, but deputies are still waiting on Allen's extradition and Kelly's autopsy. Coleman says she's still waiting as well. I'm just so sorry something like this happened. I hope they get to the bottom of what all this is coming from uh, for her sake as well as the communities. The sheriff's office says Kelly, Kelly's official cause of death, including her autopsy, will probably not be released for a couple weeks. But deputies say that doesn't mean Allen couldn't be charged in connection with his mother's death sooner. Live in Henderson County, Darren Botello, News 13.